This guy just hit me in the ass. <laughs> you guys saw good morning oh, let me fix my hair oh gosh let me just put this on. good morning guys as you guys saw i just took a very nice everything shower now i'm going to be getting ready for the day oh my goodness my hair looks a mess okay let me just put this on i'll deal with my hair later i don't even know what to do to my hair today but today is sunday um, I don't know what day it is, like number wise, 13th. Anyways, I just took a nice shower. I feel so good. So, so. Alright, so I'm gonna do my skincare and I'm also gonna do my makeup. So first, you guys already know I love these. I still haven't made my bed yet. Don't look. I will make it after this. So, today I want to get a new video up. I also need to write my paper for the honors program for the college I'm going to. Like, a lot of people are telling me, like, why are you trying to make college harder than it already- Ooh, I almost knocked it over. Okay. People are asking me, like, why are you making college harder for yourself when it's already hard? And I'm just like, girl, it's extra 5k. And I need that extra 5k. I need any extra money I can get for when it comes to school. So, I have to write a paper, but the only thing I don't like about it is the prompt is stupid. Like, the prompt doesn't make any sense. Like, I just don't understand the prompt. Basically, the prompt, like, just asks, like, what is an assignment or project that has made you develop as a person? Like, what? I do my assignments because I have to, and it, it hasn't made me develop as a person. But one thing I do have in mind, though, which I don't know if it actually, like, fits the prompt or not. But um, I did, like, a vision board in one of my classes before. And, like, it made me really, like, think deep into what I want to do in the future and, like, what I'm interested in. So, like, I don't know if that counts. I think it should count. Like, to me, it makes sense. Like, it made me develop because I had to think about what I wanted for myself in the future so i hope me writing about that is valid but now i'm going with the snail mucin ever since my sister got me this for my, for christmas i have used it every day can you see <laughs> yeah also this i have a lot of these but i will and it's almost out but i will use it until it has no more same with that um that moisturizer i mean the sunscreen um so yeah, I need to write that because it's literally due tomorrow. I didn't even know that like it begun, it began. I didn't even know it started until yesterday. Like I didn't know. And all of a sudden the deadline's tomorrow. I have to write a 500 word paper and I don't even know where to start. But I really want to get, uh, I really need to get that done more like today and then edit a youtube video going to costco with mommy and also um there's no more sunscreen in here i got a new one but like i have like to use every single drop before i throw things away so ugh. and i also need to film tiktoks for my jewelry you guys like the jewelry i put on today all drip by jay of course you know Oh, the bracelets. Don't forget about the bracelets. Oh. Dripbyjjewelry.com. Guys, don't even mind this. You probably didn't even notice it until I said something. But, um, my nails, like, one of them were coming off. So, like, I, like, peeled it off. And then I just got aggravated. So then, like, I popped all the ones I cut off. And now I look even worse because I have five nails left. But... My mom said she was going to help me take them off today. 
so then they can rest before I get a new set. There's literally nothing left in here. I've been squeezing this for, for months now. I have a new one. It's just like, if product still comes out, she's not finished. Okay. I think that's enough. Sunscreen is so important. I used to like get really lazy with sunscreen, but like realizing how important it is just made me want to like make sure that I use it. Well, I forgot to put my, um, what is it called? What is this thing called? I don't know what anything is called. I have like eye cream. I don't know. I think I was supposed to put that on before sunscreen. Whoops. Okay. Let me see if I can get anything more out of her. See, like if you squeeze it hard enough, like you get more. Maddie on a budget. Put some right here. I'm wearing this cute top. I think I got her from Marshalls. Okay, this is the top. It's so cute. But um the bottoms I'm wearing um <laughs> PJ pants right now. I'm going to be doing my makeup now. <sighs> I have not been vlogging because school is taking me out. I'm putting the eye cream still. I don't care. I remember having a uh a science teacher in middle school and she will be she used to say like high school is gonna spit you wait what is that what did she say oh yeah high school is gonna eat you up and spit you out and then like i was like um okay you're making it sound really scary and like i never believed her until now i mean not until now but like my junior year because sophomore year and freshman year is like so easy but when junior year hits, junior year was my worst year. Like, I was really going through it. And I thought that was the worst it could get until now. I'm a senior. And this this is quite literally the worst it could get. But now they're like, college is going to spit, wait, eat you up and spit you out. And I'm just like, Ugh. And then I, my little brother, he is crying about the third grade. And I'm just like, oh. Oh, my poor baby. <laughs> You're going to go through it, baby brother. He's in third grade and he literally hates going to school. But I get it because, like, school is so, like, err, like, learn. Like, no fun. Because back then we used to have fun. We used to not do nothing. But now whenever I help him with his homework, I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute a minute because like he's in third grade and like they're making them read like a whole history like a whole page of like some history document and then they have like 10 like written like written um what is it called answers and like i was like oh my god like they were learning about like the mayflower um thing and like in third grade i didn't learn about the mayflower thing until like what like fifth grade like it's like really like they're trying to really get these kids to learn like it's actually so difficult and then um my mom's best friend she has a son and he's in like i think he's in fifth grade or fourth grade he's in fourth or fifth grade and he needed help with his math homework and i helped i helped him and it was so hard like why why are they just making it harder to understand like why can't they just put it in simple forms the way they used to put it in simple forms for us so I feel really bad for them, but anyways, I'm going in with the e.l.f. grip primer. A lot of people talk about this and say like, it like changes my makeup routine and like, I like it, but I don't think it really, like, I don't know. Maybe I'm just like not good at makeup, but like people rave like about this or like sticky primers, um, but I just, like, I don't see a difference. Like, I feel like it's it's nice, it's great, but, like, I don't really see much whenever I use this or when I use, like, this. Like, it makes my face feel soft or good or cool, but <laughs> it doesn't really, like, it's not life-changing, so I don't know. That's also how people feel about setting spray. Like, people are like, it stays on all day. 
and then I put it on and it doesn't stay on all day like I mean it does stay on all day but like they say like it doesn't move it doesn't smudge it doesn't look like it doesn't change at all and then that's like so not true because I've tried like all of the recommended ones I've tried the Urban Decay Make It Last one size waterproof thingy and like I will I've tried the Milani one and like I mean it's cooling it's cool but like I keep saying that it's cool but like it doesn't really do what people say it does so am I getting scammed or what because like the the one size it said it was waterproof and then I went swimming and then I came out and then my mascara was down here and all of my makeup was gone and so I'm just like, I thought it was waterproof. Like, even the ads are, like, with people with full glam dunking their head in, like, a bowl of water after spraying that. And their makeup is not moving. I'm like, girl, it it moved. It, it moved for me, like, whenever I went swimming. Like, I feel like they use waterproof makeup and then they spray that on top. And it's like, oh, my gosh, it's not moving. I don't know. Because it was not waterproof for me. I got out the pool or the beach. I wasn't, I didn't even submerge my face into, into the water a lot. Like, I don't know. Yeah, it just doesn't work that well for me. So, I talk a lot. Oh my god. This is why, like, I can't do get rid of these on, like, TikTok and Instagram that much. Because I just, like, ramble. I never shut up. Mmm cooling i also did try the milk makeup hydro grip thing but like this is the same thing for like half the price so like why would i buy the other one again i feel like every single time like i buy like a rave product and i find a dupe for it it literally is the same thing like after i run out of my rare beauty um concealer and like liquid blush i found so many drugstore dupes or like i've heard of so many drugstore dupes save your coin girl oh look at how glowy oh my gosh <laughs> but i'm sorry you're reading <laughs> um now i'm gonna go in with this concealer I really do like this concealer though because I've tried like the NARS one. People always talk about the NARS one and I don't understand. Like I've gotten it and it's really not that great. It's really not that great. I don't, I don't like, you see like people just lie. But people still talk about the shape tape and it's been like five years. So it must be good. But I haven't, I haven't gotten it nor do I want to because it's expensive. It's my first time at Costco. I'm so excited. Okay, so I'm getting really overwhelmed because it's like really, really busy in here. But I wanted to show you guys my outfit because I didn't get to. This is the outfit. Wow. So cute, so cute. Um, so basically, I was just trying to clear my storage like before I left the house, and I also had to charge my phone. So that's why I didn't vlog, like, finish vlogging me, like, getting ready. Because, like, I know I started it, but, like, I never finished. And that's why. So I was trying to clear my storage. Where's my mommy? Mommy, please come see me. It is so busy in here and everyone's like literally like going ham. Like I used to go to Sam's. Like I have a Sam's by my house and I always go to Sam's but like I never been to Costco before and um I'm very claustrophobic and there's people everywhere and people getting really close to me and um this guy just hit me in the ass <laughs> with this freaking car and he looks at me like i'm crazy like old man oh my gosh boundaries like it's not that serious to get them grapes but <laughs> i'm getting very claustrophobic because there's just so many people in here and everyone's going crazy look at how fresh this fish looks like it looks so fresh oh my god oh my goodness they have so much seafood here. This is like Dungeness crab per section. And then this is like a whole Dungeness crab. Sam's does not have all this. Like look at this. There's like snow crab and king crab. And then there's lobster tails and scallops. Oh my god, my mom should not have taken me here. She's introducing me to this world. Like look, we got two. No, we got four um dungeon is crap i'm so excited to be here oh my gosh everything is everything is such a deal here this is like a, a taco making thing for 14 dollars 
there's a whole Asian section. Like, I'm living for this. They have tropical fruity boba mochi mango lychee passion fruit. I don't know if I'll like it, though. They have, like, taro bites and what else? These crackers and then these rice crackers. This comes in a lot. Oh, my gosh. Look, Lunar New Year is coming up. Look at all the beautiful Lunar New Year desserts and stuff. Do I want this because the box is pink? I think so. Mm -hmm. The lady just gave me a sample and it's really good. Okay, so to be so honest with you guys, the main reason why I even came here is for soup dumplings and I can't find them. But that's literally why I'm here. I really want soup dumplings. I've been seeing it everywhere. I mean, I've had it before, but like I want more. Oh my gosh, they have haikao. Haikao is so good. Such a staple like in the dim sum. And then they have some shrimp wonton ramen. Yes. <gasps> dumplings. These are not soup dumplings, are they? I don't think so. <gasps> no, I don't think so. Okay, so I called my good sis and she said this is the right soup dumpling. So I'm getting this. And then I also got Alani New. I don't know if I told you guys yet. These are the best shrimp chips. They're so good. I highly recommend. I don't know if I showed you guys my brittle. But I got like this. I got like this brittle. And then what else did I get? Oh, we also got these um, dumplings as well. Um, needless to say, I am having a blast in this store. Oh, let me fix my necklace. Needless to say, I'm having a blast in the store and I'm literally buying everything that I see because like everything's so good. Like, I feel like I'm in Disney. Like, am I getting old? Because I am so excited to be here. So, um, my brother wanted these, um, like seaweed chips, but I can't find them and I feel like he's going to be really sad, but like, sorry, baby brother, I cannot find them. This is like the one aisle where people are not stepping on my freaking foot because everywhere else people are going insane and i'm like okay like you guys are like fighting like it's like the end of the world or something like please come down there's enough for all of us guys and they have a lot of workers here i literally feel like i'm at the hong kong market like i'm seeing my whole ancestors here like period all these asians we be getting the deals all right so yes i see a lot of them here and there's also like a lot of asian like snacks and like Asian food here, which like makes me so happy because like you don't really see that anywhere but Asian stores. Um, so this is like snacks from Germany. Like I love how like international Costco is, but like it's like a cookies and cream flavored chocolates, and then over here is like brownie. This looks so good, but like I need to stop. I need to stop. Oh my god, there's like this from Belgium. It's like crispy chocolate thins, like straw chocolate and strawberry. This looks so good too. I'm like not getting all this stuff, but it's just so cool. Like seeing all these different things. What is delicious? Oh, I've never seen this before. What is that? Cinnamon swirl bites, s'more bites, and birthday cake bites. This looks so good. Oh my goodness. Okay, I love Costco, but I want to get out of here because this lady just almost knocked my phone out of my hand. Like I had it like this, like, like I was holding it in my hand and she freaking like, like rammed her cart into my hand. And she didn't say sorry and i was like okay all right like and then the other guy he pushed the freaking cart it's my ass like <laughs> i need to leave right now <laughs> please so i got a sample of the alani new um it's like the alani new like protein yeah, shake or something like that okay. it is sweet i do not like that i like the alani new energy drinks but not the protein shake. oh my gosh i freaking love these i've only seen them one time wait let me sh let me talk to you guys i gotta flip this around so like i've only had this one time because one of my aunts she went to hawaii and like she got these for me and like it came in a box and it was so good and ever since then i've been dreaming about these cookies and like i don't know i just like i never saw it again but like now that i found them i hope it tastes the same i really hope it tastes the same but like this is like a company like based in hawaii and like oh, the cookies are so good i thought i had to go to hawaii to get these but i found them oh, i feel like i'm in heaven right now oh my gosh i was literally about to leave until like i was walking around a little bit more and then i saw these like oh, i never thought we'd meet again look at how full our cart is right now um it's a lot Four 
hundred bucks later, I'm home. I'm gonna try these Honolulu cookies. Hopefully they taste the same as like buying it from the place. Cause the place comes, you get it in like a box, but this is in a bag. I hope it tastes the same. I have been thinking about these cookies for so long. Like hopefully they taste the same. good but i think the ones i got from them last time was like dipped in chocolate or like had chocolate on the back or something like that but these are really good they have they taste like um you guys know like those round trays that are blue that agents use as a sewing kit yeah that's what these taste like also I don't really like drinking sodas or anything, but Alani News, I will drink. So the variety pack comes with peach. It comes with cherry slush. And it also comes with cosmic stardust. My favorite is the mimosa one. Um, the one in the white can. But I never tried the peach before, so we're, I'm going to try the peach. I have a cup of ice right here. I love Alani New. Let me try it without ice first. Mmm. This one tastes so good. Because, like, I can't drink soda. Because it's, like, super duper carbonated. And, like, I don't know. But this, like, it's not, like, as carbonated as soda. So I can drink it. I like the peach. We're gonna try these two another day. Probably one tomorrow and then one the day after that. Um, I've had this before, but I don't remember if I liked it or not. But this is good. Okay, I need to start editing or working on my paper now because I literally haven't yet. And it's already, it's four o'clock. So we're eating Dungeness crab for dinner. Mommy's making it right here. There's four Dungeness crab. And then I'm going to be eating my Dungeness crab with the Boldak carbonara um, noodles. Yeah. And then I'm also going to be boiling two eggs. Oh, this is going to be so good. And my little brother, he does not like seafood. So I'm making him the soup dumplings. This is here. Come in, brother. Okay, let me put on the light. Put on, put on, put on. I can't talk. Oh my gosh. Huh? Look at this light that I just got from the TikTok shop. It's like about to bring my phone down, but like, let me turn it down some. Oh, yes. You see me? You see me? I see you. You see me? Like, look at that. Actually, it's a bit bright. Let me turn it down a bit. Okay, this is the dimmest. And this is without the light. Are you kidding me? Hello? It's gonna be perfect for the nighttime. Even though I don't be going nowhere at night because I go to sleep at 10 p.m. So Lucas wants to be a YouTuber today. So welcome to Lucas's vlogs. What are we doing? Oh, he's peeling some eggs. Take over Lucas, you wanted it. He wanted some vlogs, so I have had his moment. Lucas, you have to be careful because uh, said hi everybody. Lucas, you have to be careful because these eggs are soft boiled, which means the yolk is the yolk is still runny. So you have to take it off really carefully. Incoming, incoming hotness. I have to strain my noodles. Okay. Give me a second. strainer. Oh, what, man? He, um, jogging. This is so cute. 
Ủa? Mình mình gỡ Mình gỡ Mình gỡ không có tầm nữa mẹ thẻ làm trước mẹ cầm như là mẹ đổ I'm just gonna put the littlest bit. That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Throw it away. Bin, bin muốn ăn người trai mà bin nhát. Bin chưa ăn. Nhát nhát một chút thôi. Nhưng mà, bin chưa để tới. Nên nên kêu bin để chi. Tại cái này nó quá trời cay luôn đó mẹ. Mẹ thử không? Không biết nói mẹ thử King Dungeon's Crab. This is our first time trying Dungeon's Crab. We're really excited. Let me get some. You cannot make this without sesame oil and sesame seeds. So I'm doing a little bit of sesame oil <laughs> and a. <laughs> Lucas, what's going on with your egg? And then. Um, no, Lucas was trying to peel the shell off more than the shell came off. <laughs> Alrighty. And then I'm going to also put the eggs in it. Dungeness is done. And I have my noodles with it, with the soft boiled eggs. Mm -mm -mm. crab, noodles and soft boiled eggs. Yes, please. I'm just gonna record my first bite because after that, thank you, man. Because after that, I'm just gonna dig in and not talk. And get my first bite. Noodles. Mm. I love to hear you when you complain about your best friend, how she's so late. 